All right, so this here is Platinus occidentalis, um, American sycamore. Uh, this is another one of these wetland species. I'm looking at this in August um, in Jefferson City. And again, this is one that people mix up with maples because it also has um, the palmate leaf venation. But as I said, if you take a look carefully, you can actually see there's quite a bit of fuzz on the underside of the leaves. Focus for me here. There we go. So that fuzzy underside of the leaf is one of the dead giveaways. The other way to tell is the branches are alternate, whereas all maples pretty much are opposite. And then you can see here this leaf sheath, the petiole actually encircles the bud. So the bud actually can't grow until the petiole falls off. Now this bud is green. Later in the year it'll turn kind of a brownish color and you'll get this leaf scar that goes all the way around the bud. So it's a pretty neat plant. The other way that's a dead giveaway for this tree is the bark. Now the bottom of the bark looks kind of boring. It's kind of like, well, it's just kind of brown. But as we look up, we notice that it turns white. And that's because, um, at least initially, on the tree, <clears throat> the uh, bark will actually shed off. And if we look down at the base of the tree, we can see these little pieces of bark um, that fall off. And that's another dead giveaway. It's a little harder when you're dealing with a smaller sycamore. Um, this is a wetland plant. You notice there's a creek right there. And so this one um, <clears throat> is in the Platinaceae. And it's a relatively easy one to identify. One of my favorite um, eastern trees, so Platinus occidentalis.